Prophecy is a guiding light, and the gift of prophecy is a door to the supernatural. Discover more in this episode as Pastor Chris shed more light on the importance of prophecy. The gift of prophecy is a door to the supernatural. Prophecy is too important. Prophecy is like a guiding light. How were they to know about Jesus? It was by prophecy. There were so many prophecies about Jesus that he would come. The Savior, the Messiah will come. And they had to keep looking to the scripture. And the only proof that God had for the people to say this is the Messiah was to turn them to the words of the prophets. God's only proof for the people was prophecy. That these words were spoken by the prophets of God. That the Christ would come, the Messiah would come. Prophecy is vital. Have there been prophecies about your life? The Bible says with the prophecies you make war. Take them with you. Every word of prophecy concerning your life, take it with you because it is too important. Some people don't realize it. You write the prophecy down, don't forget it. Write it down. And live by it. Because if you pay attention to it, it will come to pass. It will come to pass. Hallelujah. Glory to God. <laughs> when you are threatened, step aside and pray. Pray, pray until the words of prophecy come out. When you're speaking in tongues, listen, the power is not just in the speaking in tongues. The speaking in tongues will stir you, inspire you, cause your spirit to be ready to receive a word. That, that's the thing you need, the rema, the word of the moment from God. That's what you need. That's the reason for speaking in tongues. At the time of pressure, when the pressure is high and the stakes are high and you're speaking in tongues, what you're waiting, you're trying to dig, you know, dig into the realms of the spirit, the inner recesses of your spirits. You're trying to get something from the Holy Ghost, from within, deep, call it into deep. You get what I'm saying now? And you're waiting, waiting, waiting for something. Finally, the word will come out. Then you hear, ye are of God, little children, and have overcome them. Ah. You already knew it in your head. You already knew the scripture in your mind. You already knew, I am with you, said that. You already knew that. But you want to pick the moment, the, the word of the moment from the Holy Ghost. You need it for now. You need to know that that I am with you is for now. You need to know when God says, go in my name, you know it's for now. Not just in the scripture, not just general, not just for the church, it's for this moment. You have to pick it in your spirit. Are you hearing me? That's why we can't be defeated. No matter what happens. The times the Spirit of God will tell you. He'll say, be calm, relax, I'm fixing things. Then you don't have to worry. No matter what you see. It says, fear not, be not dismayed. For the Lord thy God is with thee. Whithersoever thou goest. Say, I refuse to fear. I refuse to fear. Say, I'm a, I'm a success. Forever. Forever. Oh, God. For more messages by Pastor Chris, visit the Pastor Chris Digital Library app, available on the Apple App Store or the Android Play Store. God bless you.